We're too late. He's here. Darkseid is one of the biggest bads in DC Comics, the ruler of the planet Apocalypse, a god and a villain capable of taking on both Superman and the Justice League, all as part of his quest to dominate the universe. And now hints are emerging that Darkseid may become a major player in the DC movies, so let's take a look back at the history of Darkseid. As always, you can expect spoilers from the comics. Here's everything you need to know about Darkseid. Considering he's such a fearsome force, Darkseid made his debut in a most unexpected place, in Superman's pals Jimmy Olsen, number 134, in 1970. The character was created by the legendary Jack Kirby as part of what would become known as his fourth world pantheon. Kirby, who had co-created with Stan Lee the bulk of Marvel Comics' most popular heroes, had grown unhappy with Lee and Marvel and defected to DC. Once there, he immediately began to lay the groundwork for the fourth world. Kirby intended with these characters to create an epic mythology and self-contained series that he would not just draw, but also write. The Fourth World tells the tale of the New Gods, powerful and immortal cosmic beings who came into existence following the destruction of the Old Gods. Interestingly, this was an idea that Kirby had been working on since his time at Marvel, where he had depicted the concept of Ragnarok in a backup story of Thor. It told of the prophesied destruction of the Asgardian gods and the birth of the newer, younger deities who would follow. Once he arrived at DC, Kirby was finally able to fully flesh out this idea with the Fourth World Saga. Here, the new gods live on two opposing planets, the beautiful utopia New Genesis and the horrific Hellworld Apocalypse. Later, post-Kirby continuity would tell us that Darkseid was born Prince Yuzas, the younger brother of Drax. No, not that Drax and second in the line to the throne of Apocalypse. Yuzas eventually absorbed the immense Omega Force power that Drax had been trying to access, seemingly murdered his brother and eventually his mother too, and took control of Apocalypse. With his body transformed by the Omega effect, Yuzas was gone and Darkseid was born. As the ruler of Apocalypse, Darkseid became a despot and tyrant whose greatest goal was to find something called the Anti-Life Equation, the secret that would wipe out free will across the universe and allow him to control everyone and everything. This inevitably would lead the villain to Earth time and again, using his teleporting boom tubes to travel back and forth as he believed the equation existed somehow in the minds of humankind. And of course, once on Earth, the character and his minions, such as the winged Parademons, would find themselves clashing with Superman and the Justice League heroes frequently. Other notable Darkseid cronies include Calibac, Desaad, and the female Furies. And while Darkseid is hugely powerful, he's super strong and invulnerable and can shoot Omega Beams from his eyes, he is perhaps his most formidable when he takes a backseat in the physical action and uses his insidious talent of manipulation to terrorize his victims. You used me. I told you once, Superman. If you would not be my knight, you would be my pawn. He's a master schemer and can exploit people's weaknesses, causing them to embrace the worst in themselves. Other titles in Kirby's original Fourth World run included The New Gods, Mr. Miracle, and The Forever People. The character Orion would be revealed to actually be Darkseid's son, though he was raised on New Genesis, where he became a powerful hero destined to battle his evil father. And while Darkseid and the New Gods would continue to appear in DC Comics in the years and decades that followed, Kirby's original time on the books only lasted a few years before DC pulled the plug on them. What had been designed as a predetermined story with an ending, one where Darkseid and Orion reportedly would have ultimately killed one another, became a key aspect of the DC Universe, and yet another ongoing comic book saga that will likely outlive us all. Diabolical! Darkseid is one of the most notorious and formidable villains in the company's entire stable, a stone-faced believer in anti-life itself. His and the New God's influence on pop culture is undeniable, ranging from the obvious, villains like Marvel's Thanos, to the more speculative, as many believe George Lucas was inspired by Kirby's space opera when creating Star Wars. Dark side. Dark side. Get it? Whatever the case, it seems clear that the villain will continue to be a major player in DC's comics, TV shows, and movies. For all things comics, keep it right here on IGN. Oh.